Hey guys, welcome to Learn with DevOps Engineer channel. Like, share and subscribe for more videos. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Docker desktop for Windows. Let's get started. I'm going to navigate to the Google Chrome browser followed by I'm going to search for Docker for Windows. It will take me to the multiple websites wherein I can download and install Docker for Windows. I'm going to visit official website in here. This is like install Docker desktop on Windows. I'm going to click on this option that will download the exe file for me and we'll try to follow along with the instructions. I've downloaded the file dot exe file. So I'm going to double click on that. I'm going to double click on this docker desktop installer dot exe file. It will ask me for yes or no option. I'll say yes. The installation setup will start now. Just trying to download packages. This will take some time. So I'm going to select these options. Install required Windows components for WSL2. Also add shortcut to desktop. Click OK. This will unpack all the required files and it will try to install on Windows 10 computer. This will take some time. Installation got succeeded. I'm going to close this. Now let's try to open Docker desktop. The Docker desktop is like starting. Docker is like starting now. We got an exception saying unhandled exception has occurred in your application. If you click continue. Okay, I'm going to quit this. Let's try to open once again. Docker is starting once again. I'm going to click on continue. Let's WSL installation is complete. We need to install this. Install the kernel update. I'm going to click on this link. And try to download this WSL2 Linux kernel update package. And double click on this and follow the instructions along click next it is asking windows subsystem for linux update click yes finish i'm going to cl close this browser this is finished now let's restart this. Once again, Docker is like starting. We will see if it will start normally. The status is still showing us starting. Docker engine is like starting. Looks like it will success. Congratulations guys. We have successfully installed Docker desktop on Windows. As you can see, it is like very clear. This is like running. Now we can run a container 
on our computer on our windows computer let's do that i'm going to copy this particular command let's open powershell command line and let's try to paste that particular command right now you're seeing no containers like running now let's try to run a container docker run hyphen d is like command to run a container in a detached mode hyphen p is like port on which port you want to run the container 8080 docker getting started so the container is like running now as you can see previously we were not seeing anything in here so we can see a container running you can see the details if you want to inspect see some stats you can check how much space it is like using you can do inspect as well this is how you use like docker on windows if you want to open in browser you can do that as well local host as you can see this is like running on our local computer this is how we use docker for windows and i'm going to stop this container i can start it from here now it's like running again stop exited once again start Let's stop and delete this container. That's it guys. Thank you for watching this video. This is how we create containers in Windows.